So someone wanted to know about how tunnel visual fields could occur in someone who has cortical visual impairment or cortical blindness. And the first thing you need to know is, even though they call it tunnel, when it's a constricted field, you really shouldn't call it a tunnel unless it's non-organic. And the reason is a tunnel has an entrance hole and an exit, like the Lincoln Tunnel, and the size of the entrance is the same size as the exit when you have a tunnel field. And that is non-physiologic. The reason it's non-physiologic is if you are looking at a target, the further away the target is, the bigger your visual field is. Even though the arc subtended on your retina is the same, the circumference of the circle that you're viewing is bigger. And so your field is actually a funnel, not a tunnel. It gets bigger as you go farther away. It cannot stay the same size. If it stays the same size, it's five degrees at one meter and ten, five degrees at two meters. That is a non-physiologic visual field. And that's why if you're far enough away from a target, you can see the whole thing. Like we're very far away from the moon and therefore you can fit the whole moon on your retina, even though there's no way you could fit the whole moon on your retina if you're on the moon. So tunnel is probably not the right word. You meant funnel probably for a constricted visual field, and that could still occur on a cortical basis, causing cortical visual impairment because, and if you watch another video on macular sparing, you'll see how this occurs. If you have a homonymous hemianopsia, that is macular splitting, and you connect it to a juxtaposed homonymous hemianopsia on the other side that is macular splitting, you'll be cortically blind and you'll have poor vision in both eyes. If, however, you have macular sparing, you'll have 20-20 vision, even though you don't have any field. And if it happens to be bilateral, but juxtaposed, cortical, occipital infarctions that are macular sparing, you'll have a five degree island field or a 10 degree island field. Juxtaposed homonymous hemidopsias with macular sparing. It'll look like this but it won't be a tunnel. Because if you test the person at one meter and two meter, their five degree field will expand to a 10 degree field at double the distance. It's a funnel field in cortical visual impairment, not a tunnel field, which is not organic. A funnel field from cortical visual impairment occurs from bilateral, juxtaposed, <clears throat> macular sparing, homonymous hemianopsia.